I want to tell you that you've become almost unrecognizable. And if this is for you right now, you're, you're making people stumble and choke on their words. And I want to say that you're realizing that choosing you came with backlash you weren't necessarily prepared for. And that your temper was your Achilles heel most of your life. And if this is for you, I want to say that August of last year is significant for you in some way. Something happened, some situation came to, to what I want to call almost like a point of no return. I want to say that like a switch flipped for you and I want to say it was almost like you saw red. And it wasn't necessarily the disrespect that was being thrown at you or thrown on your name. You were no longer going to tolerate the disrespect you were showing yourself. You were no longer going to let people who couldn't control their egos hold so much space and power in your life. I want to tell you that it was your anger, it was your temper, and it was your unbalanced ego that had caused you so much suffering. But once you learned to alchemize those things, your anger and your rage became one of your biggest superpowers. Because you chose to take action in your life. You chose you chose to fight and show up for yourself in ways that you didn't even know were possible. And I want to tell you that never once did you choose to compromise your integrity. And that you have followed your moral compass in every single decision that you've made. I know that there have been setbacks. But I almost want to tell you that like your bob and weave game has been strong. And when I say that, it's like you've allowed yourself to be divinely guided. Spirits moved you here. Spirits moved you there. And sometimes what seemed like a setback was really a way to show you something, give you clarity, and show you where you needed to recognize a pattern in your life that was somehow holding you back. And I just really feel like if this is for you, something is coming full circle for you. Like you're, you're really, you're really putting the end to whatever happened last year. And like I said, if this is for you, I just keep getting August. And I want to tell you that there's still this little bit of guilt that you hold. It's just lingering. It's because I feel like when you chose yourself, there was some unintentional collateral damage. And I really, I'm really picking up on almost like a child energy here. I don't know if a child got caught in the crossfire. I don't know if it was the ending of a relationship, a change in family dynamics. But it feels very rooted in family ties. The version of you that you have stepped into is not only a gift to yourself, but is a gift to your children. You didn't make choices to hurt others. You made choices to heal. Standing your ground does not come without pushback. But you have successfully done that. We are sitting in an energy of the return of karma. In the year of 2024, which is an eight year, which is all about the return of energy. And when you realize that karma is not inherently good or bad, it is nothing more than, than reaping what you sow. The things that you are beginning to reap in your life are, are bigger blessings than you could have imagined when you started choosing you. There is judgment, there is closure, and there is justice all on your side. Continue to sit in that energy of being unrecognizable. Because those who slandered you and made false accusations, you no longer behave in a way where your words or actions can be used against you. You stand with love and grace and integrity and those things don't go without reward. Love you guys.